hey guys what's up welcome back to another video so in this video i'm going to show you how to download and install eclipse id on your mac os and run your first java program using eclipse so for that just go to your favorite browser and source for download eclipse for mac and just go to this first link from eclipse.org and here you will be able to see this older version of eclipse id so for newer version just click on this here so just click on here so here you will be able to see all the packages for eclipse id and if you want to do the web application development using java so you can go with this so for basic java application so you can just download this eclipse id for java developers so let me just choose this mac os so this will download the DMZ file for installing the Eclipse ID. So once the DMZ file is downloaded, so let me just go into this finder and let me just double click to install. So this will show some warnings. So to fix this, you just need to open your spotlight search and the source for system preferences and just go into this security and privacy. So let me just click on OK here so that it won't, it will just get away and you just need to use your password and just choose this app store and just click on open anyway and just click on open. So this will start installing the Eclipse ID. So once this is done, so you just need to drag and drop this Eclipse into this applications. So you can see on the applications the Eclipse has been added successfully so once this is done let me just close and let me just go to the launch pad here and source for eclipse so you can see the eclipse is already appearing and it will again show this warning so just click on ok so just click on this open anyway and just click on open so now the eclipse id will start so now you can just choose this workspace wherever you want so i will just keep this default and you can just check here also so this won't show again and click on launch so this will show some welcome message so let me just clear everything from here and you just need to just click on this create a java project so just click on that and just give the project name so let me just give something like first project or you can give any name and you just need to choose the java environment here and you can just keep this default or whichever version you have so let me just choose the 11 so i have the 11 version jdk so if you haven't installed the java jdk i have already got video for that so you can just check out on my description and once you do that so let me just say uncheck this so we don't, we don't need this module info.java and click on next and inside this source we can create one java class also or we can create later as well so let me just choose this and click on finish so this will create the first project so just click here and click on source and just right click the source and click on new and click on package so we just need to create the package first so let me call it first or you can give hello package or you can give a name and inside this package we just need to create the class so just right click and click on new and click the java class and just give the hello world so let me just follow the naming convention as well and just click on finish so this will create the hello world java class here so inside here we just need to write the main method so just type public static void main and inside the parameter we just need to provide the string args and inside here so let me just write the line to print something so just type system dot out dot print ln and just give some message something like hello world or you can give any message and print here and just right click and run as and java application so before that i just want to remind you that you just need to save this as well so you can see the streak here so once you save just type command s to save and this will save the file and only you can run this application 
so once you install the java jdk so you can just right click here and java application so you can see the hello world output has been shown down here in the console so this is how you install the eclipse id for java developer into your mac os thank you so much for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel